Hello everyone. This, well, we catch the mouse. Uh, I mean a, a rat. I mean. Oh, that's a mouse. Dude. This is the mouse trap. Let's check this out. Oh, this is the mouse trap. Well, when it's blinking, <clears throat> that means that um, we caught a mouse. Yeah. Yeah. Or something. Yeah. But let's check it out, shall we? <laughs> And let's check this out over here. Okay. Look at this one. Yeah, they. I'll show you a clip what I think managed to open it up. Yeah. And then we'll review the rat. Ultra. You get it? Out ultra, but it's an owl because it's at night and it eats mice. Ultra. Yeah, there's a rat in there. In the box. Yeah. <laughs> now, we're going to be talking about the ultrasonic rat trap by Ultra. You get it? L. It's like an L. And I catch the mice. Ultra. I thought that was pretty cool. So I got these because when I got the house, it was obviously vacant. And prior to being vacant, there was an elderly person living here and, you know, um, I don't think was able to take care of the property. <clears throat> I started, I noticed droppings along the side of the house and a um, bunch of old rat traps. And um, when I took down, when I did the demo or some of the demo, I saw droppings. So finally got around to getting a trap. I went with this system because uh, the other ones are just uh, a little bit dangerous um, with, you know, a trap just being exposed and and just, uh, just crushing something and I got two kids so we can't be having that. Um, last time through the house I had one of those, my son grabbed one and good thing it was old and cruddy and the coil had Rotted, uh, uh, rusted out because he's like hey pops what's this and the trap was literally just about to slam on his fingers so yeah this time I went with this I've had it up and running for about a week or so a little bit more and I really like it so let's check it out the system is pretty simple Um, there's two sizes. Oh, did I say that I wasn't sponsored or anything? I just liked it. Um, pick these up. There's a rat model and there's a mouse one. Um, pretty much the same design. You have plates for contact. When they contact, these two plates I believe they're gonna get 30 seconds of electrical shock that should put them out you put the bait at the end this one goes in through here boom makes contact gone now I think there has been times where the bait is gone and I don't catch anything so there is a pretty sly mouse um, it activates when it's locked in like that. There's an off. Tells you that it's ready. That indicates um, when you need batteries. 
battery is not included. The small one has four double A's, takes four double A's. And when you caught something, this flashes green, I think every like five seconds, maybe even 10. The bigger one takes four C batteries, batteries not included. I've got it up and running for about a week or so, I said. This one I've caught in at least four or five. Something like that. And then this one's caught in one mouse. Um, so with the four or five that this one's caught, it hasn't indicated that the batteries are dead or running low. So that's great. I was worried about I catch two and then I have to replace the batteries, but that does not seem to be the case. Um, they're pretty safe. I think for kids like that, if they take it apart, other than it being dirty, you know, they're not going to get shocked if they touch anything. I like them. Get you some. If you, uh, if you need that, it's a good solution. Um, I think this one runs like 25 to 30 bucks. And this one runs a little bit more, 30 to 40. Um, unless you have rats. If I were to buy it again, I'd probably just buy two mouse ones. It doesn't seem like I have rats. Um... So, okay, there it is. Check it out. Let me know if you have any questions. Wait, what is this? Let's do this too. Check it out. We got something on the rat trap. Yeah, let's reveal the Oprah. Let's reveal the revealing revealer. Shall we? Shall we? Yeah. Hold this to you record. Okay. A ver si no se ¡No hay nada! How did... ¡Qué pedo, dude! ¡They're a pedo, guy! <laughs> Check that out. That was a pretty cool one. Let me know if you guys liked it. Uh, we had some... Um, sound inspiration from my son, Gregory. So... Um, some of those funny clips he, he he brought those to life and um with this one was a request from wendy shout out to you and your family much love let me know if you guys want me to shoot something on whatever more coming soon remember um if you like these videos please consider liking and subscribing and uh, again thanks clandestino for the beats this one is Se Vale by Clandestino. Thank you.